Hey babes, hello, hello, hello. So, again, um, I've been following Don Wells' um, Facebook for about two to three days now. I don't usually do this, but I feel like there's a reason why I was led to follow his page. Um, I also feel like he has a lot of weird, let's just say, um, comments, you know, about summer, um with on his page and I, I I noticed a lot of people like Allie right Allie and Hunter was throwing Candace under the bus and then Candace was throwing Allie under the bus and now Don's talking about you know um Chris McDonough I think it's McDonough um is is throwing Don under the bus so everybody's supposedly just throwing everybody under the bus right um I feel like this part, there's two parts, and he posted this um, yesterday, um, that stick out to me big time, right? So he says, Chris McDonough, I think I'm saying his name wrong, but you know, you know who I'm talking about, the interview guy. So I know you're exposing me with everything you got and then some, right? That's what you do. I have fell for many traps here lately, but no more. First of all, nobody's trying to trap him, okay? I don't understand what he means by traps. Nobody's trying to trap him. We're just trying to get the full versions of all everybody's side of the story, right? It says um, here lately, but no more. Instead of attacking you, I should have been praying for you. So I guess he's saying he was attacking him because he does call Chris a straight out liar. He calls his niece Trish a straight out liar. Um, we spoke about that in a previous video. It says we all need forgiveness mm. and we all need help. So we all need forgiveness. It, it makes me feel like he knows he's guilty of something, you know, um, but he's trying to put it on Chris. So, again, trying to throw, like, you know, like a diversionary tactic, just like my cards said was being used, diversionary tactics. It says, um, say what you want about me. I'm turning back to God and summer. So, right here, you're saying you're turning back to God. So, you're telling me you left God. You turned your back on God. And what? You turned your back on summer too. And now you're going to turn back to God. And now you're going to turn back to summer. That don't even make sense to me because, you know, I always read deeper into anybody's sentences. Even if it's my hubbies, I read deeper in everybody. You understand? I can't help it. That's what I do. Um, for, for him to say, I'm turning back to God and summer. And yes, I must pray for my enemies. Why is Chris your enemy? When everything was, I, I had called everything that um, came out prior. Me and my hubby called that stuff way before it even came out and hit the news. Okay. Or the YouTube streets or whatever you want to call it. We called that. So it's not Chris doing this. People know things. People have the right to look up things. You understand? Especially when we're trying to get a big picture. Um, so why would he be an enemy when you did this? Kristen, do it. Again, throwing people under the bus, a diversionary tactic. Look at them. Don't look at me. You know, it made me mad when I saw turn back to God, turn back to summer. You're telling me you turned your back on her. You did. We know you did, you know, but up here is where it's really getting me, where I have it highlighted, Chris McDonough, so I know you're exposing me with everything you got, and then some, right? So for him to say, so I know you're exposing me, you're exposing me, is telling me that there's more to expose, as if there's still more to expose, because if there's no more to expose... It, the sentence would have went like something like this. Chris McDonough, I know you've exposed me and you used everything you got and some, right? So I know he knows there's more to expose because if you're exposing, that means you're still doing it. There's still more to expose. Do you understand? Do you, do you follow? I'm not saying Don is innocent. I'm not saying he's guilty. You know, that's not my job to do. Um, but 
What it is my job is to give Summer a voice, okay? And I will continue to do that. A lot of people like to say, hey, you know, there's other people than Summer. Don't that sound familiar? Hey, Candace, there's other people than Kanika, but you know what? I still keep Kanika's spirit, you know, with me, and not, I don't keep her with me, that's not, that's her choice, she has a choice to leave anytime she wants, but my thing is, she still don't have justice, a lot of the cases that I've done, they've gotten justice, so we were able to move on, certain ones have not, and that's why we revisit, um, Kanika's the one that started all this for me, okay, so yeah, I get it, there's other people, but you know what, go to somebody else's channel for the other people, we're working on something here, and I like to put it all together, just like Kanika says, go back to the beginning, right, it's always at the beginning, you know what I'm saying, so, I don't know, I just wanted to share this with you, I wanted to get your thoughts on this too, again, I'm not saying the man's guilty or innocent, that's not what I'm trying to do, I'm just reading what he's writing for the last few weeks, and it's a little alarming, I'm not even gonna lie, it's a little alarming, because I see a lot of, it's about summer, but you're not writing about summer, everything's about how you're feeling, and, 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 and how you're being attacked, and how nobody wants to help find summer, but that's a lie, everybody wants to find summer, and you're dogging out everybody trying to help, why is that? Again, we've been doing this, you guys been doing this with me for many years now, and there is always a pattern. Uh, always, in every single case, there is a pattern using past tense, and you don't even know. She's just missing right now, and you're already using past tense as if you already know. Okay, so, and then all those creepy things, uh, I'm not on his page, this is just a, a, a picture of his page, but I did a, a video the other day, and I show you, he was attacking Chris, he was attacking a lot of people, and these people are truly only trying to help find Summer, they could care less about him and me, they want to find Summer, okay, so, I don't know, tell me your thoughts about this, I love you babes, oh wait, there was one more thing, hold on, okay, so here, it says, if you don't think someone can grab your kid right out from under you, think again. There's plenty of abductions on YouTube. <laughs> if someone grabbed your kid and threw them in a car, by the time you fumble around finding your keys, they're down the road. But which road? Think again. Put it to the test. You'll be surprised. Why? Because did you test it? Did you test it? These are some really weird things to the kidnappers of my daughter. I've asked God, and I believe he's given me the go-ahead to plead with you first to release my daughter. And there should be time for you to repent and change your ways and still obtain eternal life. If not, I will ask God for your destruction in a violent way. What? That's weird. Um... I'm asking at this time, please <clears throat> let her come home. Um, we love her so much. It's indescribable. Mm. We're so deeply hurt. Just so you know how it will be if you don't let her go. In three days, I'm asking God for your destruction. Take it from me. Do not play with God. See, that's really weird, okay? Because you don't pray for people's destruction you're supposed to pray for your enemies right that's what the bible say pray for your enemies he's talking about he's gonna pray to god that he is destructed in a violent way so this is very off to me it says honestly i feel like trump was trying his hardest to stop the organization crime okay candace dreamed that she was fishing with summer and summer caught a beautiful big rainbow trout hmm I learned something very interesting today, and it was to share it. I can't help it. Thanks so much. I got it to get off here and get the boys ready for church tomorrow. Child trafficking statuses. I'm sorry, statistics. One of Summer's favorite songs was Godzilla. I dreamt that Summer was with me on a commercial construction site and I asked her where she had been and she said down the road I woke up with a word 
Madonna, repeating over and over. We've been praying to God to St. Angels. There's a map. Hmm. Join the summer was between a commercial thing. Is there anyone like Samuel who knew God personally? Who one could go to and inquire of the Lord for help? I think it's a shame on our country's part that anyone can just go into Mexico unchecked. That's weird. And then you're married. So March, you're married. April's some puppies. And then... She's just gone. Just like Kenna said, she's just gone. She's just gone. Don't these psychics feel fear God? Don't ask us to allow them on our property. But they ain't no psychics here, right? Jesus. Do they not understand that there are prophets in the Bible? <laughs> there are. Why don't you want a psychic on, on your property? Why not? Why wouldn't you? If if my baby was, was missing, right? I would want every psychic to come on my property and give me any type of lead that I could follow. I would follow every single lead. Right or wrong, I would follow them. Right? I'm just saying. It's just a lot of stuff that is just not sitting right with me. He talks about how he's so godly. And then he talks about violence and, and destruction. And and I was in the dark. I'm sorry. I was in the deepest, darkest pit. No way out. Well, this, is, this is a little concerning. Because your daughter's missing. And you already said you feel like she's in a dark place. And usually they identify with what they what they done did to the, their victims. I'm just saying, not him. I'm just saying a person that, that, that has done this, they start identifying. You understand? Just curious how many people know this. What What is Satan's greatest tool? The Bible. <laughs> if you're asking me, I'd say the Bible. But, <laughs> but you understand what I'm saying? This is a lot of random... Weird stuff, man. I feel like he's he's trying to let us know without letting us know. It's not like he's trying to let us know. He's trying hard not to let us know, which is letting us know. Does that make sense? See, the thing is, he says he has his Facebook only friends, but that's not true because I am not his friend, and I can see his his entire page. I am not his friends or nothing like that. So, why would you want all this public? That's to people not friends if you don't want to be in the spotlight. You understand? He knew what he was getting into with Chris. He he allowed, he gave consent for this interview. He knows what he spoke about with Chris through Chris's interview. Okay? I didn't watch everything that he spoke about that, that last interview. I didn't watch that because there's no point. I already know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I already know this. Um, so he goes on, on saying that he... That Chris, you know, lied, just straight up lied about him and twisted everything around. But he didn't. You told this. You understand, you understand what I'm saying? I feel like he's trying so hard to take it off of him that he's letting it slip onto him. Do you understand? All right, let me know in the comments.